Hi, it's Jennifer at Jennifer at Home, and I'm so happy you're here today to make the easiest ever homemade strawberry shortcake. Okay, friends, I have the shout out jar today. I'm gonna pick a name real quick, and then we'll get on with our recipe. Today's shout out goes to In the Kitchen with Karen. Today I pick In the Kitchen with Karen because she has one of my favorite channels that I really enjoy watching, and I know you would enjoy watching her channel too. This strawberry shortcake is so easy and so delicious. I cannot wait to show you just how easy it is to put it all together. Homemade strawberry shortcake is really so easy to make and so delicious when you make it yourself. The first thing I did was take about a half a pound of strawberries and cut them up. And before I get started, I always look in the package to find the cutest strawberry that I can find in the package. And this is gonna be the garnish that I'm gonna put on top my strawberry shortcake at the end. So I've washed all of these, cut them up, and of course set the special little strawberry aside. Now I'm gonna add about a tablespoon and a half of sugar. And then we'll just wanna toss this. I just take a couple spoons and toss this around. And you can even do this the night before and have it ready to go, especially if you're having a party or get together and you're gonna be really busy the next day. Okay, these strawberries are going to macerate, which means they're gonna just basically soak in the sugar. They're coated in sugar and they're gonna sit in the refrigerator and we'll leave them sit in there while we get everything else ready. Now it's time to make the whipped cream. I have a cup of cold, heavy whipping cream. I have a tablespoon and a half of sugar. And I'm gonna add a tablespoon of really good Mexican vanilla. We'll get the mixer going on low, just till it incorporates, and then we'll turn it up on high until soft peaks form. Don't be afraid to stop and check it along the way. You wanna make sure that you don't end up with butter. So I just have a nice little soft peak here, and this will be just right for our strawberry shortcake or any other dessert that you wanna make with soft peaked whipped cream. After seeing how quick and easy this whipped cream was, and it is tremendously delicious, you may never ever buy whipped cream in the grocery store again. I'm gonna be using homemade biscuits. I made homemade biscuits in my previous video, so be sure to check that out. They went together so quickly and easily with only two ingredients. In just minutes, I had homemade biscuits. Or you could easily use angel food cake or a pound cake that you purchase at the grocery store. You won't believe how easy this is and how delicious it is when we put all of this together in just a matter of minutes. Now that everything is done and ready to go, it's time to assemble our strawberry shortcake. I have a biscuit that I made the day before. I made these yesterday, and this will be in my previous video, or you can just wait to the end of this video and see how easy it is to make these simple, two ingredient, super easy biscuits. The first thing I'm gonna do is put on some, I think I'll put some strawberries on and I try to cut the pieces all about the same size, so that way they're nice and uniform, and it's easy to eat these bite-sized strawberries. Then I'll add a little bit of whipped cream. Then I'm just gonna set the top of the biscuit right on there, and it's okay if it squeezes out or juice gets all out, that's okay because this is meant to just be a big fun dessert. I love to make this especially for the patriotic holidays and add blueberries on top. My grocery store happened to be out of blueberries right now, but for Memorial Day, 4th of July, Labor Day, Veterans Day, any patriotic holiday, look at that. This is gonna be delicious and of course, the big strawberry right on top. And there we have it. A beautiful 
strawberry shortcake that was so easy to make and it'll be so delicious. I hope you pick up some of these ingredients at the grocery store and put together this homemade strawberry shortcake in your home and realize just how easy it is and how delicious. I would love for you to subscribe if you haven't already and be sure to click the notification bell and don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and I'll see you next time.